Today we're gonna talk about some of the best Blender add-ons for simulation and visual effects that you can use as a Blender artist to save time and take your work to the next level. These add-ons are not organized in any particular order, so with that being said, let's dive right in. RBD Lab This is a new add-on for Blender that helps you take full advantage of Blender physics and particle systems, from fracturing objects to making them explode, adding smoke, debris, or advanced use of constraints. RBD Lab allows you to do things in Blender which could take you a lot of time otherwise. Not only that, but it can do more. It has a linear workflow, from fracturing, rigid body, constraints, simulation, particles, and more. It streamlines the process and speed up the workflow tremendously. And it has advanced features such as the emission of particles only from the chunks that break or acetones which allows you to deactivate constraints and demolish anything that comes in contact with them. And you can also use many advanced features such as this as well. Animation, Particle and Physics Simulation Expander This is also a new Blender add-on for simulation and creating real-world physics. If you use Blender for simulations, particle effects or even motion graphics, this add-on might be for you. It is a tool designed to unlock new possibilities by offering conversion from particles to animated widget bodies and secondary explosions using the Blender particles and physics simulation systems. It offers many functionalities that Blender does not have by default. And what it does is that it's gonna help you expand on these functionalities. And what it can help you do include the ability to voxelize the mesh and colorize it, using constraint generation automatically, which applies constraints to different objects based on search distance, in addition to tower generation and much more. Particles Link Particles Link is a tool that allows you to create awesome particles effects. It makes it easy to connect a bunch of particles, and it can also be used as a curve generator and particle tracer. There are actually unlimited things you can do using this tool, especially when it comes to motion graphics, because your imagination is gonna be the only limit to what you can do with it. Particles Link operates using two graph nodes, which can be a network of multiple lines. The good thing about this add-on is its ability to connect particles live and give you feedback as you work on something. Also, it is possible to use multiple particle systems as well. Spiderfy add-on this is a powerful Blender add-on that allows you to create amazing simulations of crowd or insect animations in a short period of time. You can do this easily with a high degree of control using different settings that allow you to get the results you are looking for. This add-on is great for adding unique bug effects. It can be especially handy when working on VFX shots and animation shots where there is a need to create moving insects, whether it be flying ones such as flying locust, crawling ones such as spiders in the background, or even close-up shots because the insect assets are well designed and they are very well textured as well. And they look great in both Cycles and Eevee. The add-on comes with different assets and intuitive user interface, providing you with the ability to add various creature board particle systems with animated 3D assets attached. This will save you a lot of time and effort if you are planning to include bugs or insects in your shots. Waterial. This add-on helps you do one of those things that you don't really know you need until you do, because making a shoreline or seaside ocean scenery in 3D is quite a challenge. And most importantly, it takes a lot of time and calculations, especially when the scene covers a big portion of the ocean. And if you are interested in creating these types of scenes, then this tool might be for you. It is good for creating animated water surfaces with low memory requirements in addition to being much less performance intensive than simulations. In addition to that, the node group allows a lot of changes to materials to be rather easy. This is the case if you don't like how materials look. Noisy Cutter This is an add-on that seems to be able to do nice things when it comes to cutting stuff, whether it be simple things such as rock or metal, to complex things such as human beings or complex organisms. And the interesting thing that it is able to do is to draw natural cuts using noise or using a texture. During the process, it will make the cut look realistic and believable. This add-on is easy to use because you only need to go through three steps. First of all, you need to draw the cut, then adjust the settings for mesh density to a type of displacement, and then perform the cut. The add-on can be used for environmental design because it will allow you to draw cliffs with simple cubes. In addition to that, 
it can be used for destructive simulations to cause something if it has been destroyed. Some of the most important features it comes with include noise-based displacement cut, texture-based displacement cut, and automatic cutting materials. Fracture Iterator This is another add-on for creating fracturing simulations inside Blender. It will basically help you break stuff with the help of the internal self-fracture add-on. One of the nice things about Fracture Iterator is its ability to enable dynamics on the fragments at the current frame while keeping previous dynamics ahead. And some of the most important features the add-on comes with include the ability to bake simulations to keyframes, controlling breaking time and modifying it along the process, in addition to the ability of unifying texture option space for perfect use of generated UV mapping and much more. Blaze. This is a nice add-on that can help you create different things such as explosions, blasts, fire, smoke, and more. It is shipped with more than 35 different color presets with great depth in colors to create different fire effects for a variety of use cases. It also comes with many shaders to speed up the workflow and increase efficiency. The latest version of the add-on introduced procedural shaders that work even without any mental flow simulation. These procedural shaders give you results instantly without experimenting yourself with simulations. For now, there are three procedural shaders, candle flame, engine exhaust flame, and fire. Chaos add-on. This is a tool that allows visual effects artists to customize explosions and fire within a short period of time. With its assets, it provides the ability to procedurally add various particle effects, including fire explosions, smoke explosions and various particle debris such as glass, concrete, rock, tree branches, dirt, wood pieces, and much more. The add-on also offers a cool fire volumetric shader to make the process of creating fire and explosions much better and easier. And using it, you can control smoke color, density, and contrast, in addition to flame color, brightness, contrast, and color ramp values using just a couple of nodes. Molecular Script this is a particles collision add-on that makes particles collide for creating certain types of simulations and effects, in addition to particles linking as well. So overall, it can use particle self-interactions with other particles and all the types of linking that the add-on supports, like linking at birth and linking after creation. There are a lot of applications for this add-on, especially if you're gonna use it with visual effect systems. The molecular script is a fun and free add-on to use. You can experiment a lot with it because there are so many settings that you can change to get different results. Cube Surfer add-on. This add-on allows us to remash a particle system in real time. It works nicely with the molecular script add-on that was originally created by the same developer. Using them together, it is possible to create amazing effects and high quality simulations. For example, we can use it to create bounciness effects using a soft body like cloth or solid bodies like balls, in addition to solid bodies melting effects. In the same vein, it is possible to add tier effects with amazing results, and of course, the more complex the simulation is, the more hardware and time intensive it's gonna be. And finally, Flip Fluids. This is by far the greatest simulation add-on you can use with Blender. So if you want to create liquid simulations, this add-on is what you seek. Don't look any further. The custom-built fluid engine of Flip Fluids is based around the popular flip simulation technique that you can also find in professional tools such as Houdini, Phoenix FD, Bifrost, and Mentaflow. I believe using this add-on is the closest we can get to professional quality using Blender. With this add-on, you can do a lot of things, including generating and simulating millions of foam, bubble, and spray particles to give a scene realism to create large bodies of water in addition to different kinds of liquids. Also using the viscosity solver, it is also possible to simulate thin, silky smooth liquids in addition to thick liquids that buckle and coil and anything you want in between. If you are interested in one of these add-ons, you can find the necessary links in the description. I hope you found this video useful and informative. As usual, if you have something to add, you can leave it in the comment section below. Also, you can check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much and I'll see you in the next one.